videos please make sure you start this video off by clicking that thumbs up button as you guys can see i am in my car yet again yes yet again yet again fucking around with gold my 100 you know what i'm saying let me stop i ain't gonna blame her not on today but i gotta blame somebody so yeah gold my 100 she she got this she she influenced this shit got me in the car because I'm going back to the damn thrift store. I'm not going to go first. I'm going to go to the mall first because Juice Man, what the hell? These people, do you see this nigga? Running across traffic. But anyway, the Juice Man um, needs a new badge for, well, not a new badge, a new badge. He needs a new badge holder for work. And they have them in the fashion jewelry store um, for a dollar. I done bought him so many of them damn things and that's why because they're coming out of the damn fashion jewelry store they're, they're not of quality So I think what I'm gonna end up doing I'm gonna buy him one or two out of here because he tears shit up so easily But they are cheap. I'm gonna buy him two out of here And then I'm gonna go on Amazon or eBay and find like a really good quality one and buy him that so he can take it to work so he don't be goddamn tearing up the damn badge holders cuz he said he's been going to work and swiping his bags and they keep saying uh, swipe again because it's not readable because he's carrying it around in his pocket right now because he tore it up. You know what I'm saying? Uh, <sighs> annoying. But anyway, we are about to head to the mall. I might end up running into the damn Bath and Body Works. Y'all know, I mean literally, the fashion jewelry store and the Bath and Body Works is literally next door to each other. Like, I, it's, it's impossible not to to go on one and without blah, 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 blah. see that's that's the lord telling me bitch you lying because you don't need to go into no damn bath and body works and i don't family i don't see yesterday i did good i stayed the hell about a bath and body works on yesterday because they had them three wick candles in there for nine dollars now y'all know i love me some bath and body works and i love me some candles but that's one thing about me i love bath and body works but i can't see myself paying on nine dollars for no candle hell and i damn sure can't see myself paying two for 22 that's just too high for me now maybe my nose just ain't as potent as some people knows but i be lighting them damn candles i can't really smell them like that i would rather have the um the room deodorizer that they have i would much rather have that than have the um the candle because the candle really don't do anything for me the only thing that i would use the candle for is like because it's cute you know and at night you want to have like some little relaxation shit going on and you want to put it around the pool and you know kind of relax or whatever that'll probably be the only reason why i'll just light a candle but i'd rather go in walmart and buy those five dollar candles that's just me though you know what i'm saying why is this dude flashing his damn light are you smoking crack the fuck okay okay if you're trying to get somebody's attention flashing your damn lights ain't gonna get my damn attention that shit ain't cute what is Okay, anyway, I'm sorry, family. Okay, back to the to the task at hand. We're about to head into this mall and um all that good things and, and, and yeah, all that good shit. I need to be going to wash my damn car, but it looks like it's about to rain, so I might just let the rain do the job. But I know I need to put some soap on this bitch. It need to be some soap put on this bitch, but I don't feel like doing it. I cleaned out the inside and uh Neglected the outside, y'all. I need to show y'all the inside of my damn trunk. My mama was talking shit about me because the inside of my trunk literally looks like a shoe consignment store. Y'all, I got so many damn pair of shoes in my trunk, honey. I will never, okay, I will never be without a shoe. If I, I don't give a damn what kind of shoe I need, what, what's the occasion? We need to wear some heels up in that bitch. Okay, I got two, three, four pairs. Okay, we flats. Okay, I got a couple of them tennis shoes. I, I really ain't got no tennis shoes, so I can't lie about that. Ain't got no tennis shoes. So what's going on here? Can I can I turn up in here? Okay, yeah, I can turn up in here. I don't know why that sign's right there though. Right lane ends. Oh, that's on up there. Cool. So I am almost to this mall family, and we about to go up in here and see what these folks are working with on today. I hope y'all uh, enjoying these damn vlogs. I enjoy making them, but like I said, I hate making stuff and people. Um, you know, if you don't really want to watch it, but at the same time, you know, I kind of want to do what I enjoy doing, which is vlogging and just talking shit and thrifting. That's what I absolutely love. I love thrifting, but I hate going thrifting by myself. You know, I wish I had a, a buddy to go thrifting with me. It'll be so awesome. So, yeah. But Family, we are me. headed through the mall or well, in the mall. I'm not in there yet, but I'm going through the back entrance. Do you guys ever do that? 
I don't know, in the front it just seems like it's a whole bunch of kids and shit that be hanging out since it's the summertime. And by me vlogging, it said, oh, I thought it was a fucking frog, y'all. So leave in a minute. It's people standing out here. So I made it inside. And now, that's the reason why I like coming in here because it keeps me from going in other stores. Because as soon as I hit this corner, after coming down this long highway, highway, hallway, <laughs> which is right out on the parking lot, I'm going to come right up on the fashion jewelry store, which bypasses me from all of the other stores in the Temptation. So, winning. These are the jewelry holders, not jewelry, badge holders. Can you believe that all of this is one dollar? One dollar. One buck. And these are all of the necklaces. This is where I got my girl, Miss Aloha's love mail. I mean, they just have so many cute pieces. So many cute pieces. Ooh, look at that. Isn't that cute? focus in on it. One dollar. Super cute. Super cute. Oh, that's cute. It's real cute. And they have scarves. And they have some um, cosmetics over there, but only thing I'll buy over here is the lashes, personally. The lashes, personally. I don't need any new necklaces or anything. I do need to see if I can find me another Eiffel Tower. I get so many compliments on it. And oh, that's kind of cute. That actually matches the dress that I have. Hmm. I don't know. Okay. It's time for me to get out of this store. These are all the bracelets. I mean, just owls and owls and owls of shit. Okay. I'm leaving now. <laughs> So I did good. I did not buy anything out of Bath and Body Works. So we're about to head to the thrift store. That's the fashion jewelry store up there. In a minute. So family, we are headed into our favorite store, aka the thrift store. Shirt and shoes are required, really? No shit. So of course I'm having to come down the shoe aisle. Ooh. Are these unique? Where's the price? I just want to know. I wouldn't wear them. 
family, family. I ain't gonna do it. I ain't gonna even do it. Not today. I'm gonna put them back. <laughs> we gonna put those back. One day though. I love flats. I gravitate towards those. You can never have too many pairs of cute flats. I have enough seven dollars though. Who the hell are these by? Okay, these are nine west as well, but not no nine dollars. I mean seven dollars. Bye bye bye. Not used. Mm. I have a pair of these. I have a pair of these. They're not um exactly like these, but they're pretty much a close match. So I definitely don't need any more of those. I don't even wear the ones I got. Check this shit out. What the fuck? A scripper. Okay, family. Now these are unique. I may actually wear these. I don't know with what. But these are cute. Let me try them on. I actually like these, family. Let me try to get my foot up. They're cute. Are they not? Y'all probably saying, take them shits off. And I agree, but they're cute. I like them. Do you like them? Hmm. I don't know. Family, I don't, I'm getting these. Why? Simply because they are Ed Hardy. And they're unique. And I'm never going to find them again. So, I got to have them. So, they are going in the basket. Yes, ma'am. But I need to get the hell off them over here. Quickly. Those shoes are still here. Remember these? <laughs> oh, these are cute. I wonder if they work. Mm -hmm. Those are cute. What the hell are they? Is it a radio? Oh, it's a CD player. Cool. Attack of the teddy bears. Y'all know I love me some teddy bears. But I don't need no more teddy bears. No more. What the hell is that big ass thing up there? Um, creepy. That's a voodoo doll. I'm not really finding anything amazing in here today. So, yeah. Nothing amazing, really. What's that? Oh, those are little plastic bowls. Oh, but this is kind of cute. Oh, it is glass. That'll be so cute for my kitchen to put like, um, like the fake fruit in $6.99 I think it's 50% off that is cute no cracks or anything I actually like this it could even be a serving bowl and it's glass you hear that mm. again nothing spectacular that's the thing that they use to like if you're having a raffle or something how much is it I can probably use this for my giveaway when I have giveaway. Hmm. That'll be interesting. We're gonna get it just because it's all fifty nine. What the hell are those? What the hell is it? Somebody tell me what this is. Because I don't know. What would you do with that? It's two of them. It's 79 cents, but what the hell what the hell is it for? Okay, so I found this little miniature jewelry holder. It's 79 cents, so I mean you can't really go wrong with that. I think I'm gonna go ahead and get it. So I can use this to store some of my earrings and stuff like that. So it's it's cute. 
I said I wasn't coming over here. But I you, you can't come in here without coming over here. I mean you just can't. The shit is just too damn cheap. Okay, those are large. I need to come down here. Oh O C D. Okay, I found this really, really cute Nine West clutch, and it is, uh, let's see if I can get you guys to see it, shit, $1.59, focus, damn it, $1.59, and I just think it's adorable, I mean, going in the basket. Mm. Well, isn't that just adorable? <laughs> for somebody else. Definitely not for me. kind of cute I like big bags though but I do like little clutches like this to throw in my big bags to like keep you know little lippies and all type of stuff in yeah okay family since we did not find too much stuff in the thrift store I have to go across the street to the dirt cheap yes I have to okay I have to don't judge me anyway I'll see y'all in dirt cheap Dirt cheap. Okay, why is, why are you blurry? Okay, there we go. Dirt fucking cheap. We're about to head inside. So, we're inside the dirt cheap. And they also have clothes, in case you guys didn't know. Aisles and aisles of clothing. So, y'all know. I gotta see what they got up in here. I love this. It's too much animal print though. And it's seven dollars. And it's the white tag, so it's sixty percent off seven dollars, but it's too much animal print for me. Let me see if I can do an outfit of the day. Okay, today is sixty percent off day. So I doubt if I'll be buying anything out of here. I like to come in here when it's ninety percent off. Yeah, but they have a lot of cute stuff. I noticed the shelves are usually packed when they're 90, I mean 60% off. But when they get 90% off, people start buying the hell out of this shit. And it says $24.99, so 60% off $25 would be like $10 for that. That's a wine rack back there. This is the most random ass store ever. And it tells you, please test all electrical items to make sure they are meet they meet your expectations, because they accept no exchanges and you get no refunds, because the shit is so cheap. I mean, yeah. So they do have electrical outlets for you to test all this stuff before you buy it. Now that's cute, a designer bulletin board. 60% off $10 would be like $4, but I don't need anything like this, but it's cute. It's cute in store. What is that? Butterfly 3D deco light? I don't know what the hell that would do, but it's interesting.
And this is what the dirt cheap looks like on a regular. It's always just thrown up there. And that's why the shit is like a dollar, two dollars. Because you literally have to dig for the shit and they do not accept returns, which I mean, obviously. So I always tell people, unless you're ready to look, don't come in here because you're not gonna find anything. But if you have patience, you can literally find some treasures in the dirt cheap. Look at this mirror. It's broken though. It would have been $12 now, but 90% off, it would be like super cheap. What the hell is this? Is this a chalkboard? That's odd. Remember this? I have one of those in my uh, my office. And I'm gonna try to do the outfit of the day. It's a lot of people over there by the dressing room, so I can't get to the mirror without looking awkward and talking. So I'll do that shortly, hopefully. And like all of these bins, you have to literally dig through that shit. But I don't, I never do that. I always look for the stuff that's on the shelves. The little boys look at me like I'm crazy. <laughs> he thinks I'm talking to myself. Pillows, rugs, all that stuff. That is a really nice rug. My mom would actually love that. She's coming up here tomorrow to go shopping. So hopefully that's still here because I'm going to show her that because that's 50% off so she can get that for like 30 bucks and that's a huge rug it's 5 feet by 7 feet she would love that and it's cute and soft yeah I gotta show her that tomorrow okay family what the hell is this it's cute but what is it mm. looks like it probably used to light up it said burn what does that say focus burn within sight the hell it's a flame why are you showing blurry thank you I need none of that. None of that. They even have toilet paper in here. Family, I'm trying to find a mirror, but these hoes in here are all over there by the dressing room. And they're never like that. They just know I'm trying to do an OOTD and they trying to, you know, jog my shit. But this is all the comforters and sheets and stuff. Yeah. Like they got comforters in here for like five bucks. Queen size comforters that are brand new they're just here some of them have rips and tears in them you have just have to look at it but five dollars for a queen size freaking comforter dude you just can't go wrong okay i'm in love i think i'm getting these two chairs they will be fifteen dollars a piece family these will go excellent in my bedroom as to like sitting chairs love it what do you think 15 bucks a piece hopefully they're still here tomorrow because i don't have a truck and my mom has a truck so yeah i'll be back for you okay they changed things around in here as well um i don't see the pillows and things like that oh and somebody told me all you do is shop girl where do you get your money from that's really none of your business <laughs> but to be brutally honest i have a job I do work, even though I work from home, I do work and my honey works. You know, we are two working adults and I'm spoiled and he lets me have what I want. And I don't think there's anything wrong with that. I don't think that's any of your business where I get my money from anyway. Just watch my fucking video or leave. <laughs> like that's, I, well, that's one of the reasons why I think I got so many thumbs down on my other thrifting video. Like what, what's the problem? I don't understand. I love watching people thrift. Like entertaining 
And besides, I mean, I know you have nothing to be jealous of, but why are you thumbing down a thrifting video? People are so dumb. But anyway, moving on. I know you're going to thumb down this one too. And please do so. This is all the tr Okay. Crock pots and teapots and coffee makers and what is that? Baby cakes, popcorn poppers. I'm looking for a fool in these mirror. They normally have them over here. And you can really see how big this store is from here. It is huge. These shoes, family, are all seven dollars. Seven dollar boots. Brand new, never worn, seven dollars. And these right here are, let me see, some are ten, some are five, seven. Depends on the style. Okay, family, those mirrors are too damn dirty. So, fucking OOTD, I guess. Fucking OOTD. Look at these. Ooh. Those are bad. How much are they? Where's the tag? Uh, I think they're eight bucks. Cause they're on the side with all the eight dollar things. Those aren't bad for eight dollars. Are they in my size? They're size 10, so let me try them on. Do you like family? Are they not bad? These are so cute, oh my God. I want them, but I'm not going to get them. They're a little too big. This mirror is so dirty, but you can kind of see my OOTD. As you can see, that's a dirty mirror. But I have on this really, really cute black wrap dress. No necklace. I have on, you can kind of see these earrings, kind of. And my sandals with my gold toe. Y'all can't see that shit. But I'm about to get the hell out of this store. Because... This video is long enough, so I hope you enjoyed. Subscribe.